Systemic juvenile idiopathic arthritis is one of the most severe form of chronic arthritis that affect children. And is characterized, besides of arthritis, by the presence of systemic symptoms that include eye spiking fever, myalgia, a rash, hepatosplenomegaly, lymphadenomegaly, so enlargement of the spleen of the liver, enlargement of the lymph load, and uh, inflammation on the pleural and pericardium. The impact is important because, apart from uh, the systemic symptoms like fever, these children have arthritis, Julia, severe arthritis, and you can well understand uh, the fact that you can move freely your joints, affect uh, the, everyday quality, the quality of life of every day, from taking care of yourself, uh, to playing with friends, to going to school, to clean the stairs. So it's really a huge impact. And so from one side uh, is a big burden for all the family, they can even affect the solidity of the family. From the other side, uh, of course, uh, the, the, the parents uh, help these uh, children, their limitation. But on the other side, uh, they, was, they should also be very keen uh, in allowing the child to blossom in his own personality, not to cover him, not to protect him too much. So it's, uh, it's very important. It's, I should say central also uh, the cooperation between the doctor and the caregiver. Caregiver is one of the most important aspects of uh, treatment. Development of rare disease is very important and as you know very well there have been uh, also law that has been implemented both in US and uh, in Europe uh, to protect uh, the development of drug for rare disease because uh, Although a few people are affected by rare disease, uh, there are many thousands of rare disease. So the real impact of rare disease on the health of the general population is very important. And since the market is relatively small, of course, in this patient, uh, the collaboration between the, the society and the industry is important in order to try to solve the problem, to provide a better treatment for rare disorders.